But there's like there's so many segments that you carried as the hurricane. It wasn't just like a one off like little one liner. Like that backstage segment with the rock that everybody kind of points to, that's like seven minutes long. Yeah. And it's just like zinger after zinger and joke after joke with this great story that's being threaded through the whole thing. That is not easy to do. No. It's not easy and all the pressure was on me. Mm. You know, people don't realize that. Like if if I go out there and stink it up with the rock. He's still going to be the rock. You're never going to see me again. Even, I mean, even going into the match, you know, people, uh, you know, we, we were talking a little bit earlier about uh, Logan and Ricochet you know, and who's the pressure on you. Yeah. yeah. Like, Pressure's on you, right? The pre- yeah. <laughs> well, as a producer, yes, the pressure is on me. I'm going to get yelled at if this goes sideways. Yeah, it won't. But, um, yeah, but with Rocky, I was like, yeah, all the pressure's on me. Because if this, when we have that match, if this match sucks, he's still going to be the rock. He's still going to WrestleMania against Steve Austin. Mm-hmm. You won't see my little ass anymore. <laughs> <laughs> if, I, if I go out there and blow it with the rock, it's going to be over for me. But it wasn't just a segment. It wasn't just a match. It's a win against the rock. Yeah. And that's not a lot of people can say that. Not lately, anyway. I think it was his last match on Raw, too. His last uh, main event or something like that. Man. Yeah. Yeah. And like, I ran him out. It was a loser, right. loser leave raw match. It, it, I mean, I recently rewatched that segment, and I was like, the amount of heat that heel rock had. I think people mm-hmm. kind of forget, like, because he's so fun to cheer for. Yeah, but he had the audience in the palm of his hand, whether he wanted you to cheer or boo. It was amazing. Yeah, he's he's one of the best performers there's ever been. 